rolling easy here back in the easy garage okay i thought i'd uh show you a video on some movie cars now if you guys have been collecting for the past five or so years hot wheels you will know these hot wheels entertainment cars and i'm i'm going to show you some older some older entertainment cars movie cars so they did these if you were been collecting for about say the five years but seven years if you've been collecting for let's say 10 to 15 years you may remember these johnny lightnings and they were doing movie cars they did a ton of movie cars but we're not going to talk about hot wheels or johnny lightning because they made tons of them and you guys have probably seen them but before 15 years, if you go back about 20 years, other companies were making movie cars. And we're going to show you, I got a 48 car case, and it's going to be like a two-part video because we'll just do one side. Let me show you some of the movie cars that the other companies did. Let's take a look and see what I have in this case. We will do one side. Now this is the Back to the Future DeLorean. And this one here came from Hollywood Studios Orlando. And you could buy it in a gift shop. Very cheap model. But that's what you got in the gift shop at the Hollywood Studios. You can see the wheels kind of like a China car. But that's what you would get. So that's the Back to the Future DeLorean. And here is a Ertl. The Fall Guy. TV show. Not a movie, but TV show. The Fall Guy. These are hard to find without the, the top broken or the hitch broken off. But this one's in... Looks like a mint condition here and that was made by Ertl the Ertl company put out a lot of cars um, Ertl and Corgi let's see what else we got okay this one speaking of Corgi a Superman little van there made by Corgi there's a Superman on the side. You can see it's got the Corgi wheels. It says U.S. Van. That's all it says. Corgi Jr. Made in... Oh, I can't see. Made in Great Britain. Corgi. Yep, that's what it says. Made in Great Britain. Next up. Another Ertl car. Dick Tracy. You see it on the back. This was the only Dick Tracy model I kept. The other ones were kind of corny cars. But this one was very nice. It's a little, little dusty, but it was a blister pull for me. Pulled it back, you know, many, many years ago. Dick Tracy car. Next up. So you guys can look for these things because... These are things you're going to find at garage sales and flea markets. Look at that Charlie's Angels TV show. Another Corgi, Corgi model. The same band as the Super ba Superman band. Even the back glass. So uh, there's another one. Charlie's Angels. You know Hot Wheels and Johnny Lightning did a lot. And uh, there's not going to be too many... Um, Corgi did a lot of James Bond cars, and that's going to be a whole nother video. And Ertl did Dukes of Hazard, and that's going to be a video. Big time video. Next up, one of my favorites. Ertl, Cannonball Run. That's the first car. Well, not the first, because you've seen the Lamborghini in the first scene, but this is when they... Um, 
come over the hill. This car was probably in the movie for, I would say, three minutes, maybe. And they did the casting on this, and they, they did not do a casting on the Lamborghini. Surprisingly, don't know why, maybe because the girls were driving it, and they didn't want to market that to the kids at the time. I don't know. Anyway, there it is, and we'll stay with the Cannonball Run cars. Here's the car that the Sheik drove from Cannonball Run. I'm looking for all these in blisters. I have a couple. I'm not sure which ones, but I'm chasing them in blisters. I got a few of them. Rolls Royce Silver Shadow Cannonball Run from the Sheik. That was a cool one. And here's another Cannonball Run. A little rougher. This one's a tough one to get in fairly good shape and in blister. The two, uh, two dudes drove it. And um, that's that one. You guys haven't seen the movie, you need to look at it. Burt Reynolds, Cannonball Run. Here's the vehicle from Cannonball Run that Burt Reynolds was in and Dom DeLuise. This is the vehicle they drove in the Cannonball Run, if you guys haven't seen it. The paramedic van, you see it on the hood. Cannonball Run. One more. Here is the Ferrari from the Cannonball Run. And I'm trying to think of his name. I can't remember who was who was driving it, who was in it. Oh, I can't remember their name. Anyway, that's the Cannonball Run cars. Now move up to this one. It's not die cast, but I'm sure it came with a die cast trailer. Look at this thing. Miami Vice. I love this thing. Look, it's it's plastic. Well, it is broke. But I have not seen one since I got this. So I'm sure it had a trailer or something. I never researched it. I don't know why because I love it. But that is the um, cigarette boat from Miami Vice. And if you guys haven't... Uh, Watch Miami Vice or you're too young. You need to look them up and go look at Miami Vice. That's how it was back in the day. Back in South Florida when I lived there. Cigarette boats. Here's a, um, this one's not Ertl. But it's a Knight Rider 2000. It's an off-brand. Ertl made one. Also, but this is an off brand of the Knight Rider 2000. Not sure who made this one, it's really, really long compared to the other die cast. But that's the Knight 2000 kit. Up next, both of these Tom and Jerry. I've had many of these. I started out with a rough set. Me and my buddy were collecting and I've upgraded to these. I've seen them in the blister and they go crazy in the blister. But I, I'm not going to buy them that crazy. I, I'm not crazy about them. This one has a cannon. But I've upgraded. This one's pretty much mint. This one's got some chips. But eventually I'll upgrade that and I'll be happy with the Tom and Jerry show from... TV. Here is your, as I started, the Ghostbusters car right here that Hot Wheels did. Also Johnny Lightning and this one is like an off-brand. Real cheesy, real short. Don't know where it came from. Not quite sure about it. 
It's got looking like corgi wheels on it, but it's not a corgi. Or it could be. You guys let me know. But little cheesy uh, Ghostbusters car for the uh, that is in my movie collection, off brand. Riptide. That was a TV show. This is a Ertl. It says Riptide on the hood. You can see it there. It is an Ertl car. Ertl wheels. Love the Ertls. Back in the... I got a lot of Ertl um, NASCAR cars. We'll do a video on that. It was a Corgi. Corgi police car. And that was um, City of Metropolitan. I believe this is from a um, like a Superman. It's a Superman movie. City of Metropolitan. And that was the police car from that movie. Matchbox took a stab at these movie cars they did about six or eight something like that and this amityville this is amity amity this is actually from jaws they did a terrible stab at these movie cars but i do have them all and that was the jaws car from jaws actually a boat but jaws die cast New movie coming out has to deal with the relations to the Batman movies. We're sick of the Batman cars, but here is the Joker Corgi. The light's pushed in a little bit, and it's got something on the glass, but it's on the inside. It's not cracked. Very good condition. Corgi model. But that is the Joker. Up next. Let's stay with the Batman theme. Another Corgi model. The Penguin. That is in good shape, Corgi. It's got the little penguin in there. The tempo on the top is rough, but there is the Corgi model. I'm showing you these so you can keep a lookout for them. Maybe you want to add them to your collection. Hot Wheels did this one, and this one is a Ertl. And it is the um, the A-Team van. This is a... These are not too hard to find. But uh, Hot Wheels did the A-Team van also. And this was a blister pull. And I do have another one in a blister. So... They're not that uncommon to find and fairly reasonable priced. Back to Batman. Let's see, this one is a Corgi Jr., another Corgi. Batman helicopter. Corgi did a lot of little helicopters like this. Kind of used the same model throughout they did a bunch of them and these are in the also in a lot of the James Bond the James Bond cars we'll do a video on the Corgi helicopter Batman another Corgi and this is from when I was a kid so I've had this car forever and I'm surprised it survived it's a Corgi Spider-Man Spider-Man helicopter. You can see all the webs on it. It's pretty neat, pretty cool. But when I was a kid, I had it. I wasn't really Spider-Man fan, but I had it and I played with it. I played with that car. And I'd say that's in, oh my goodness, at least a 8 to 9 condition. I didn't beat it up. Last but not least, on this side, and then we'll do another video. The Wonder Woman. 
a little Wonder Woman car. This one's made by Corgi. You can read it. Very good shape. I had one beat up a couple years ago. Finally got to upgrade this one. And you don't see them that often. Wonder Woman little car. Never seen her in a car. We know about the Wonder Woman jet. But there's her little car, Wonder Woman. But um, my sister loves Wonder Woman. She always say, Wonder Woman. Anyway, that's all with that video. We'll do two parts. I'll do the other side of the case. If you like this one, don't forget to check out the next one. Subscribe to me. Hit that bell for notifications. And check me out on Instagram, Roland underscore easy. I appreciate all you guys watching, subscribing. And stay with me, stay easy, keep on turning Hot Wheels.